if we come back to the top tips, you said fluid front loaded, salt with your broth um, and exercise, which will be good at reconditioning your body. And I think exercise is a key aspect of autonomic recovery. And the question most patients ask me is, how do I know when I'm better or I'm, I can do more? And I say to them, listen to your body. When you've gone through a day where you've been upright most of the day, you've gone for a brisk walk, or in your case, a 40 minute cycle, and you come home and you feel good. You don't feel over, uh, overexerted and you're not washed up for three days after, you're recovering. And actually, be kind to yourself in that you might still have up and down days. For example, uh, you mentioned when we last met that your monthly cycle may also be a factor in down days or very bad days. Do you want to tell me a bit about that? Yeah, so I found that in the days leading up to my period and maybe at the start of my period, uh, some of my symptoms would flare and become a lot worse. And then obviously um, mood, mood um, swings have always been difficult for me during that time, but now it seems they are a lot like um, enhanced a lot or that's an aggravated response so to say so um i found it helpful um and it kind of goes back to what you're saying about the other stresses the financial i mean the, there were definitely times when i was worrying as well because i'm a freelancer and I, ca I can't get sick pay and these things they they stressed me out and that added to that and what um what i did is um i i got some counseling through through the nhs actually um, to help with cope also with the uncertainty of the situation, for having an illness that no one has really know exactly what it is yet officially, um, even though there are some um, indicators and the uncertainty of how long it will last and um, whether it will be permanent or not, or whether you know all of these all of these things uh, to have um, someone to talk to um, who is a neutral um, person that really helped and also helps to have these tools available during that time before you before my period when I know okay this is a bad day but tomorrow will probably be a better day and also having experienced that a few times I know it will pass again and that does help a lot that knowledge. I mean, that, that is one of the fundamental um, mindsets of re recovery. And I, I can't emphasize that enough. From the time I first met you, I kind of uh, was very impressed with your mindset. And you appeared to understand everything I said and had the expectation of recovery. And to a certain extent, if we take a step back and we look at the role of the autonomic nervous system, it is ultimately to look after your subconscious or automatic functions, right? So um, unlike my, my finger, which I'm moving by a thought, I'm thinking, move my finger, or I'm thinking, speak, and I say these words, it's a very conscious effect. I am not thinking heart beat faster, and you are not thinking that. It just happens, right? That's how the autonomic nervous system works. So if I said to you, what are the inputs into this autonomic nervous system that could influence this? And I would say these are feelings rather than thoughts. Because when you feel good and you feel hope and you know that you have an expectation that you will recover because you understand things, and then you do your exercise, you come away, you don't feel that bad, you feel quite good, you instill that very positive emotion and your autonomic nervous system ultimately are is influenced by emotions and feelings so i think it's very good of you to keep that positive mindset and actually as you said when you have a setback and your monthly cycle may be a setback it may not be the only setback you might have financial setbacks social setbacks relationship setbacks or whatever random flares of autonomic disturbances, a very hot night, for example, unseasonally so, may, may make your next day really rubbish because you've lost a lot of fluid, more than you can recover, even with your drinking. Know that this is the waxing and waning of the autonomic nervous system, and soon this will also pass. So just having that knowledge and actually putting a positive slant will also help. 